。翻嚟第三場嘅賽後，你點睇？我立即望下第五呢、這個五班啦，千二屠城啊！嗱，呢場個步速咧都早段幾快，我哋馬上望一望先。大門係二號嘅神朗金光賣到三十四蚊嘅。咁但係嗰只合金王平時佢都唔係自己放頭跑嘅，今日啲飛啊冷落啊。即係佢上咗口，仲要其實都冇吞翻轉啦。飛啊，今日都得人驚啊，十一倍啊，吞到呢啲初頭以為贏得嘅馬啲飛啊，軟弱到不得了啊。係啊，你睇佢即係頭兩段都四十五秒五六㗎。都採用咗個與同以往有啲唔同嘅方跑法，就放一頭嘅。佢又快過標準時間一點五三秒，我覺得佢太過快啦呢場。放喺度快到超過一秒咁咧，快過係啊，快好多啊！佢唔係平時唔係放頭跑嘅馬嚟，但係又配合咗啲飛冷落，又改變咗個咁嘅跑法，呢啲啊真係令人好多好多疑問喺度嘅，成老子都係問號。不過呢場都有延伸㗎，我哋陣間都可以睇一睇啊！但係佢放得咁快都算叻喎，嗬。嗯，頂到先。咁但係點咧？而家後邊淺藍色帽嘅即係潘頓嘅神朗金剛啦，叻就唔係好叻嘅一隻馬。不過佢都發揮得好好，撲跟上嚟㗎啦！呢度已經哇，內攔咗隻當家信心。誒，呢度做乜？佢又俾佢慳下位。咁但係出邊有啲馬衝到上嚟都唔錯，只平山新星啦，只十一號。咁我睇下第三場嘅分段時間究竟有幾快啦？頭段二十三秒五零嘅，第二段二十二秒零六啦，末段係二十四秒五零，賽事時間一分十秒零六啊，五萬嘅。咁啊，賽後有延伸就是、兼抗議嘅喎。係啊，我哋一齊望望啦。神朗金光，哎，同埋合金王。其實睇個細神朗金光過，合金王冇啊，強路之末嘅啦已經。咁大潘隊呢度俾佢壓一壓，佢有骨牌嘅，就唔落得邊。佢有影響到，同埋掉到佢咯。你見到啊，神朗金光嘅馬身都即係失咗啲平衡。咁你睇未啊？幾步直情嗰支邊啊，要再做天線啦。咁啊，結果就抗議又竟然就唔成立喎。係啊。但如果你要再次睇咧，只誒神朗金剛咧，係唔係真係可以拉斯過到只合金王咧，都係一個問題。因為拉斯衝落去咧，佢嗰個第四名都未必係，就算冇影響都未必真係太威脅。呢個董事嘅睇法啦，我諗董事覺得佢過唔到，但我自己覺得佢過到咯。而家實際上好似嘅記錄上個距離兩隻馬大概係相差四分一馬位咯。咁但係你見到佢嗰度係打緊邊，跟住你尾嗰幾步係冇，同埋個細啊嘛，即係講個細。嗰只合金王其實已經係停，跟住掉出嚟嘅。呢只就係一步一步追上嚟嘅。即係喺個關鍵時刻嗰度，佢要避佢，同埋係唔止避佢咧，係受到佢嗰、那個成只馬掉咗出去，跟住停一邊啊嘛，啲邊就喺度做咗天線啊嘛。係啊，咁啊，結果呢場賽事咧就延順結果啦，都冇改變到個賽果嘅。我哋又望下一場啊，睇完第三場之後望下第四場啦。嗱，國際騎師錦標賽嘅第一關嚟啦。咁啊，大二滿喺邊匹？竟然係八啊！佳運發其實都覺得呢只馬超超地噶啦，見到佢啦起步冇幾耐，但係唔係最前嗰只，諗唔到啊！個以為佢本身有口啊，佳運發佢本身有口，啊估唔到十一咁快喎，電腦七號，居然可以快即係放嚟咗成兩三個馬位嗰啲電腦七號，之前冇顯露過咁犀利嘅速度，放咗出嚟之後跟住啊鬥翻住嘅，其實潘頓都唔想佢走得太快喺度，一味捉翻住嘅。佢又盡量控制啦，我覺得呢場。下一次都可以繼續睇噶啦，電腦七號。如果試難啊，試加三贏咗啦，真係。睇個馬姿態咧，佢係急嘅，但係潘頓你睇下撳翻啲步速，其實佢就撳得好好噶啦。係好，佢想偷呢場賽事。係啊，冇冇辦法啦。咁啊，佳運發之前啊試過左前腿不能一行退出，咁然之後重新做翻功夫，通過咗 O B 之後咧，再整多課習嘅。結果呢場啦，拉士透出嚟就贏啦。你睇馬昆尾嗰幾步真係。<笑>呢啲英英國騎師嘅功架，即係後生一輩騎師呢啲都真係好手嚟。有體力啊，而且其實都唔係易追啊。當然今日就 B 難啦，即係放頭啊，唔係好著數。但係你睇下佢呢啲功架，一食落去，嘛富高八斗都係恰如其分啦。不過有啲片咯，係啊，講只二號啦，最尾啊跑第二。恰如其分，佢呢個路程佢未贏過嘅，其實不過成日都會有啲二至四名咯。嗯。好啦，第二名嘅照片咧就係影到出邊嘅富高八斗啊，即係二號馬。第四場分段時間啦，頭段係十二秒六一啦，第二段係二十一秒四五嘅，每段係二十三秒四一，賽事時間五十七秒四七。結果咧呢場賽事啊，大衛希斯係贏咗只佳運發喎。今日希斯嘅首風幾順喎，不如睇睇連馬斯點講。
Uh, it was only a small injury, but I, as I think he's such a good young horse, I didn't want to take a chance. And to win at 1,000 metres, which is well short of his distance, I think he's got a lot of promise when he gets to 1,401 mile. So uh, I think he's an exciting young horse. Nia Tom's riding ability and especially strength over the last 200 metres. I think he's got world-class strength. 咁我睇完希斯方面之後啦，馬迷都有啲嘢講嘅喎。咁我哋呢個環節咧有馬迷討論區嘅。咁啊見到啦 ，C T M 就話啦，真心佩服阿頓哥啊！咁啊只電腦七號咧出閘嘅時候咧，竟然係盡快啊，仲要快過只街運法，咁真係無人所不能啊！咁啊好明顯係電腦七號出閘好 sharp 嘅嗰下。係。咁啊，不過都當然只馬本身有嗰個速度先得嘅，都其實先係即係呢啲速度嘅嘢，其實先能夠幫少少嘅啫。但係講真，誒喺快活谷上演嘅呢個國際騎師錦標賽，咁啊呢啲場地最緊要都係講反應噶嘛，係、嗯、咪？講出道啦，能夠做到咁好嘅反應，即係攞到個先機咧，咁啊都係好出色嘅。阿希斯啊讚啊馬坤係即係世界級騎師咁啊，世界級騎師雖然輸啫，不過都係幾<笑>真係好世界級啊！係啊，好世界級。咁啊，誒，另外呢場啦，都有位騎師停賽，就係、是、巴杜嘅富高八斗喎。點解要停賽呢？我哋一齊睇睇董事點講先啦，不如。咁就、呃、去到就第四場啦。咁啊，巴杜啦，其實富高八斗啦，喺誒直路嗰度咧，就不小心拆旗停賽嘅，因為七十五米嗰陣時咧，佢就一路騎住過嚟打住邊咧，咁只馬就移咗入嚟，就橫越快一步嘅跑線啦。咁呢度呢，就阿巴杜呢，就成日不小心拆騎嘅，咁就罰咗兩日停賽兼加多個三萬蚊嘅罰款嘅。咁佢就跑完十月廿二號之後呢，就停廿七同埋廿九呢兩日嘅。咁頭先希斯嘅訪問或者街運發千四千六仲好啊，咁呢一晚都要有啲改變先得，因為而家朝頭早仲係比較急跑，其實你見佢早段佢雖然跟唔到嗰只電腦七號，但佢自己都有啲口啊，即係要攆到口先跑到千四千六啊。今日臨場見佢都仲係好多動作。哦，你而家跑一千喎，你一千要上千四千六。都要一個程序嘅，真係。佢話日後啫，佢就未必即刻可能即刻跑長啲路程嘅，可能跟住都係跑一千千。金季之內得唔得啦？真係。仲後生啦，咁都係跑緊第二場嘅賽事啫。咁啊，咁快交到成績，唯一要諗嘅就係究竟希斯馬房嗰啲馬再出係咪可以 keep 住一個咁好嘅形勢啦？我諗呢只都得嘅，呢只冇問題係嘛？不過即係頭先講嗰樣嘢啦，如果佢仲係咁多動靜啊，未係好收斂嘅時候。又加情嘅話咧，咁嗰陣就要小心啲啦。係啊，因為呢一場都好多挑戰啊，轉跑谷草啦。咁其實頭段都唔係淨係得佢一隻馬快噶嘛，佢又醒啊，即係定一定住先，俾其他馬即係攞到個頭段之後，慢慢再逐步加速啦。有前景嘅馬嚟嘅，將交運法立做其中一選啦。我哋往下一場賽事先，咁啊下一場咧就係國際騎師錦標賽嘅第二關啊，五場四班一六五零途程。嗱呢場好多嘢可以睇下噶，咁啊但係二門係四嘅博愛之光，不過呢場就有少少混滯啦。咁望下最尾嗰。直路 decision， 佢個 judgement 係咪啱咧？可以睇下導演引線啦，最開邊嗰個，一馬騎一出嚟，跟住可以定翻慢喎，即係呢，就係呢手工價都唔簡單，因為一馬騎行咗啊嘛，跟住你望空啊嘛，佢即刻可以鬥翻慢只馬先嘅，先做啱咗第一步先。咁啊，前面嗰只就排一檔嘅大順，誒排四檔嘅大順威啦。大順威都預咗佢放㗎啦，埋門市個千七米谷草集就放咁咪佢跑個短途嘅。不過導演真係見到，哇！呢位女騎師嘅功啊，真係唔係唔係人咁笨啊，真係好犀利去拉屎。講真，你一六五零米賽事，唉、哎，抽個十二檔，佢又唔係咩，即係佢冇乜路程戰績啊嘛，係咪冇路程戰績都唔係上風嘛？你諗住可能都係要敲負十二檔擺前啲，但係你擺擺到喺第二位之外，又要撳得到咧？就真係唔容易啦！真係唔容易啊！你嘅頭嗰段都唔係個個做得到啊！唔好以為好簡單啊！真係。係啊，因為呢場賽事你橫觀翻啦，有幾隻馬未出頭啦，但係呢場可能都爭少少。咁但係你又再睇喎，其實好多馬咧爭成一六五零都 O K。會唔會咧？其實原本嗰班嘅四班一六五零嘅馬唔係咁犀利，令到啲馬咧轉程都可以即刻攞到啲。啊！即係炎炎元帥本來都幾有能力嘅，不過入到直路佢抽唔到出嚟喎，佢跟住又專一喎。博愛之光都係啊，抽一輪都未抽得出嚟，嗰度個入到直路佢有少少內閃咗埋去，佢失咗個線嘅。裏面等咯，係啊，望下佢覺得佢覺得只馬有喺裏面嘅等啦，結果上嚟遲咗啦，其實轉一爭少少啊，其實終點之前嗰步咧仲係過緊怪獸騎兵啊。我以為有啲機會出頭嗰啲馬都。佢都有諗過㗎，即係擺呢個二中中遊位置啊，驚俾馬封住啦。咁我哋喺呢個角度真係再欣賞下啊，導演欣同阿潘頓鬥落去嗰度。
幾精彩啦！係啊，佢又真係踢一踢馬㗎。其實嗰只佢啊，嗰只怪獸騎兵咧，其實騎落去係閃嘅，但係你睇佢一路抽住嗰陣時，一路打，一路抽住，一路打嘅，一路打一路踢我呢度，一路逼住。鬥拉屎，哇！諗緊潘頓，誒、哎、裏面嗰只杜遠恩嚟喎，怪獸騎兵，咁啊林拉屎嗰部啊輸個馬鼻位啦，睇下幾近就知道啦。咁啊，結果怪獸騎兵就影贏只專一嘅。專一都係未出到頭住啊！咁啊，第五場嘅分段時間啦，頭段係二十七秒五九啦，第二段係廿三秒一七，第三段二十四秒三六，末段二十四秒七六嘅。咁啊，賽事時間一分三十九秒八八。咁啊，見到杜遠恩啦，嚟到香港就即刻手執咧呢只怪獸騎兵幾十倍嘅冷門馬喎！我哋一齊睇睇呢位女騎師咁犀利嘅方面先。I have to be honest. I thought I'd just been headed post, so I was a bit unsure. And all the lads were saying, "Well done," and I just deny it until you hear the result, don't you? So it was great that he he, he kept on. He was tough. He um he's obviously been running over six and seven furlongs, so I knew he had the early gate speed he needed to adopt a prominent position, and um had to work quite hard to get there. But to be honest, once once we got there, we had it easy enough and got into real good rhythm between the four and the three. And he's just grinded it out. He's got a big heart, so that's good. 佢真係講係講得輕描淡寫啊！要即係早段騎咗出嚟，要 keep 住個 rhythm， 即係 keep 住個穩陣，因為你騎行嗰只馬佢會有口噶嘛，嗰、那個好難嘅。我覺得佢好謙咯，咁玩咁壞只馬，好好鬥得啊！其實好鬥得嗰個都應該係佢。係啊！<笑>我諗如果你唔知係即係求其睇條片，你根本唔會知道一個女騎師嚟嘅。係啊，係啊，即係、啊就是、有時見到佢啲眼光砌落去咧。比其他男騎師都不落下風。不過呢場賽事有位騎師停賽喎，就係、是、騎炎炎元帥嘅連達文。我哋一齊睇睇董事點講先啦。而去到第誒五場啦，即係誒炎炎主帥騎師連達文咧，亦都係不小心插旗要停賽嘅。咁雖然就係佢第一次過終點冇幾耐之後咧，佢就埋嚟咧，咁就未有足夠帶嚟嘅湛江最醒。咁即係埋咗嚟之後，令到何澤瑤嗰度咧都要立備嘅。咁呢度啊，連達明都係成日咗不小心拆嘅，咁就罰咗兩日停賽，咁就跑。佢因為佢誒會翻澳洲啦，咁因此咧佢嗰個停賽日期咧都係等於香港嘅兩日停賽，咁佢就係誒等於香港嘅十五誒十二月十五號同埋十八號呢兩日嘅。其實佢早段就攝得好好嘅，十檔攝咗埋欄，咁但係轉彎攞翻出嚟喺專一，後面想抽出嚟嘅時候咧，佢慢咗抽唔到，咁可能只馬都仲係有少少自亂啦。不過今日連達文本其實連場嘅發揮，如果你同啲歐洲騎師比咧，都比咗落去嘅，冇辦法啦，真係。冇冇冇啊！杜遠恩啊、馬坤啊嗰啲咁長，麥道朗嗰啲，一陣睇下麥道朗嗰場跑得幾靚啊！真係。不過誒呢一場就真係可以話，即係啲人啊騎得好精彩。不過我諗啲馬就。第日再跑嘅時候小心啲啦，即係始終專一啊嗰啲都唔係話真係咁。專一其實睇翻佢直路嘅時候啦，其實佢直路係出錯腳噶。咁啊，見到阿潘頓一路咁壓落去啦，中年之前都係攞唔到嗰個頭馬，覺得其實只馬嗰個平衡點上面咧，仲需要慢慢學習嘅地方啦。不過能力上究竟可以加幾多分咧？可能真係要之後再諗諗同埋度下啦。咁有啲嘢都可以賴下嘅專一。咁至於其他馬啦，咁我覺得譬如盡力之城啦，因為其實呢幾次嘅賽事當中都 prove 到呢隻馬呢冇以往咁好嘅速度，咁所以早段呢，佢都跟翻個中游啲嘅位置啦。咁啊，下次又要再睇下呢隻馬。咁雖然賽績上即係、就是、以往贏嗰啲馬都唔錯啦，咁但係今次跑完會下次可以繼續跟呢，度一度啦。我自己就意見比較保守啲嘅。下一期返嚟啦，我哋再埋第三個環節啦。下次睇埋第三個環節先。